And um, so now we have uh, Emily McDermott up here, which I'm so, so excited to perform with her. And um, so the next song that we're going to do is another one of these true stories. Um, and it's a particularly uh, brutal one. So this is the, the Ballad of Pearl Bryan we're going to sing once I eat tune. And um, so Pearl was one of those women that was... Um, was pregnant when she got murdered. And um, there's a lot more gruesome details to that, unfortunately. You'll hear some of them in the lyrics. But one of the things I've thought about with studying these songs for a long time is like, these, these were real people, these were real people. And um, who were they before they were turned into basically formulaic stereotypes, right? And, um, you know, this is something to, to consider. This is not just a song. This was someone's life. Um, we also decided to add a chorus to it. And then, um, I don't know, em Emily, would you like to say something? Sure. Um, when I was researching the murder ballads, there are so many, unfortunately. This one really stuck out to me because no matter how many times I came back to it, the only thing I could hear in my head was, this could have been you. This could have been you. <laughs> Even to this day, I'll be driving down nine to a job and I'll just go, oh my God, <laughs> you could have died. So many situations, so many circumstances, people I was hanging out with, things I was doing, my poor mother, if she only knew. <laughs> this song does not end well for Pearl, but hopefully through programs like this, we can prevent it from happening in the future. What's happening? Gee. I'm in the wrong thing. Yep. Uh, and that's what happens. So I'm going to unplug this. Yes, okay. Yep. And then we're going to take that thing. This is a this is a highly complicated operation here. Uh, that looks good. Uh, yeah, I think that's the the right one. Okay. 